Okay, let's get started. So today we received a question on how to add a markup to a billable expense uh, for items purchased for a customer. In order to do so, we need to turn on a couple settings. So let's go to the gear icon and account and settings. Under account and settings, we're going to go to expenses. You go to the pencil, just click in the middle. And here, you'll see the markup with the default rate of. Once you check it, you can put a percentage that will be across the board or leave it blank so you can uh, manually edit whenever you want to add it. Hit save and done. Once your settings are saved, we can test it out. Let's go to the plus icon and under benders, click bill. And once it loads up, we can select our vendor. Let's use a sample one, sample category. You can write your description here, advertising for the, uh, well, actually, eh, doesn't matter. Okay, <clears throat> $1,500. We're gonna make it billable. And now we have the markup column. Let's put that 30% in there and we can select the customer. Let's say it's cool cars. Make sure your dates, everything is filled out, terms, on and on. So we are billing cool cars, 1500 plus 30%. Save and close. Once it's saved, let's go to the plus icon again. And now let's create the invoice. Okay. And now let's select cool cars because that's who we selected. And now you'll see the billable expenses there. Okay. Once again, ensure that all your terms, everything is good to go. Um, the expense and the markup is already in there. One thing to note is, let's pull the preview up so you see how the invoice is going to look. Okay, so here the description that we typed in, the service date, the total amount. If from time to time, depending on the settings you currently have, you may, if you don't want to show the markup, or if you do, let's go to the gear icon and go to a custom form styles, which is where the templates for your invoices are. Whichever is the one you use, hit edit. Under content, select the, where the items will be listed, and towards the bottom, show more activity. Here you can show the markup on billable expenses, or leave it checked off and it will not show the markup just an option so you know all right hit done and that is how you add a markup to your billable expenses uh, don't forget to subscribe uh, leave a comment below if you have any questions and give it a like uh, and we appreciate it